In this lesson, we shall learn about how we increase an amount by a given percentage. The prices of houses in the town increased by 15% over the course of a year. Here we have the prices of house A, B, and C at the start of the year. And the same houses, their prices at the end of the year. And we can see that they've all increased by 15%. House A had a value of 220,000 to begin with. House B had a value of 140,000 pounds. And house C had a value of 194,000 pounds. And we are told that all of them increased by 15%. So, in order to find the new value of the houses at the end of the year, we take the original value and we multiply it by 1.15, which is called the multiplier. Now, when we apply the multiplier, we will see that um, it is basically the percentage expressed as a decimal added to 1. Now, why is that? Well, we know that when you multiply any number by 1, you get the number itself. And so this part of the multiplier ensures that we get our original value back. And then when you multiply it by the percentage as a decimal, it will then give you the final value, which in this case is 253,000 pounds. Same thing here. We started off with 140,000 pounds. We multiply it by the multiplier, which is 1.15. And so we get 161,000 pounds as our answer. And in the last example, 194,000 pounds times 1.15 will give us 223,100 pounds. What is important for us to understand is that the multiplier basically is the original value, which is represented by 1, plus the percentage, in this case 15%, which as a decimal is 0 0.15. And that is what we're going to multiply the original value by. Let's go deeper. When we increase an amount by a given percentage, we multiply the amount by the multiplier. The multiplier is simply the number that we multiply the original amount by to give us our answer. Well, you may wonder, and you should, how do we get this multiplier? How do we come by it? Well, the original amount represents 100% because that's all you had at the beginning. And so we add the percentage increase to it, in our example, 15%. So 100%, which is the original value, plus 15% will give us 115%. And so this 115% expressed as a fraction will be 115 over 100, because we know that percent means out of 100. So 115 over 100, well, we know that every fraction is really a division, right? So 115 divided by 100. And we know that when we divide a number by 100, we move the decimal point twice towards the left. So we get 1.15, which is our multiplier. So as I said, the multiplier is the number by which we multiply our original value to get the correct answer. And it's always basically made out of 100%, which is the original value, plus whatever the percentage you are increasing it, expressed as a decimal. And that's what we're going to multiply by. Well, whether you understand it or not is found out by being able to answer these questions. Have a go at them and let's see how you do.